And here we are. After six days of close battles, many surprises, and lots of passion, we've reached the dramatic medal race for the RSX women here at the ISAF Sailing World Championship. The races started with Davidovich sailing ahead and Korsitz, Shaw, and Ling very close behind. Sofia Klapatska was determined to score the bullet and had no other choice but to pump as furiously as she could. However, it was not her but Davidovich that rounded the mark first. Klapatska and Alibo were just behind. A strong and dramatic race indeed. Alibo had some issues and lost meters, so to make sure that she would not lose a medal, she pumped like crazy. Number 17 in the world, Davidovich, was leading the fleet while Korsitz had no choice but to do her best to secure her lead in front of Mass Livitz if she wanted to hang on to her gold medal position. Impressive how hard she is pumping. She will not let the gold escape her. She will give it all to be the world champion today. Take her mouth, bitch. Get yourself high, got Meanwhile, Sofia Klapatska put forth a great effort. For her, the second position is not good enough. She will give it everything she has to try and steal the title from her friend, Korsit. But she only managed to leapfrog Alibo and grab the silver medal from her. All three best in the world as of today are so exhausted after such a demanding race. What a moment seeing Korsit, Klapatska, and Alibo lying on their board. The girls worked hard, performed well, and had the stamina necessary to win such a demanding championship. Korsitz and Kaplatska have been fierce competitors all these days, but that doesn't mean they can't be best friends too. So happy, I'm so happy. Look, we have also the same tattoo. Wait, wait, wait. Power of sister. Sister. What's the relevance of the tattoo? Where's the tattoo from? You know, we speak, we have a deal. I've been, I'm European champion. She's, I'm the world. Marina was in the no. So who takes the Olympics in gold? <laughs> Even Marina Alibo seems happy, although she lost the second place just a little before the finish of the RSX women. I'm super happy, she said, and very tired as well. She went on to say everything begun very well in the medal race, but with Sophia this close, I was doing my best to overpass her. At that moment, a marine plant tangled with my fin, and this made sailing really tough. So I was not able to get on planing. I had to jump in the water and remove the plant, so I lost an almost sure chance to be the silver medalist. Still, I have made a big step toward the Olympics. There is still one event in Madeira, and if everything goes the same way, I will be in London next year for sure, she said. Congratulations to all the girls. Let's have a look at the final result. Korsitz kept her number one position, but that was not the case with number two in the world, Britain's Shaw. She lost another place. Not a very good way to end this championship. And that was all for the RSX women in the ISAF Sailing World Championship. Don't forget, the RSX men's races start tomorrow. So stay tuned.